Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Princess Renny here and I hope you're doing well. On this channel we talk about Christian faith, lifestyle as well as natural hair. This is a tutorial on how I styled my purple locks in uh, I think it's about 15, 16 different ways. If you're interested, definitely stay tuned. So for the very first style, I'm going to go ahead and get the side of my hair. Um, I'm just going to do a side part and just leave my hair down. And that's it. Choose whatever side you prefer and just leave your hair down. And then the second style is kind of a style, but kind of not really a style. It's just like, you know those moments when you wake up, you don't want any hair in your face, and you're just like, I can't figure out a style right now. Just push it all back, and you have no part. It's just all back. And then the third hairstyle is going to be the center part. I live for a center part. I made sure that when I did this hairstyle that she parted the center so I can have that as an option. So this is style number three. So the next hairstyle is one of my favorites. I'm just going to get some of my hair kind of in the center at the top. And I'm just going to wrap it around itself and create a top knot. And this is style number four. So after that, I'm going to go ahead and get the hair that I left out on the side. And I'm going to wrap that around the original top knot. And then now you have a half up, half down top knot hairstyle. <laughs> So this next hairstyle features two space buns. You just get one side of your hair um, and then just spin it around itself until it creates a bun and then do the same thing with the other side and then you leave the rest of your hair down and you have a half up, half down space bun hairstyle. Next up, I'm going to do another half up, half down hairstyle, but I'm going to leave these two um, strands of hair, which is like called an antenna or tendrils. Just going to keep those in the front and then the rest of my hair is going to be half up, half down. All right, guys, now it's time to get rid of the tendrils. I'm just going to take it and wrap it around the um, ponytail that I have in the first half of my hair. So now you have a regular half up, half down hairstyle. But I also like to put it to the sides, give it a little cute little edge, um, make it look a little, little bit different and all of that. But also speaking of putting your hair to the side, I love to choose one side of my hair and just put all the hair on one side. Like, it's also another really cute hairstyle. And for hairstyle number 10, I'm actually going to try to put my hair up in a ponytail. It is such a struggle because I have so much hair and really tiny hands. But um, <laughs> you guys are going to watch me struggle for like the first two to three times. Um, but then I finally got it. And then yeah, you just have another hairstyle. This is hairstyle number 10. Okay, so we finally got it. So now that your hair is in a ponytail, it's so much easier for you to put it into a bun. Just take the hair that was left out, wrap it around the middle of your hair, the top of your hair, and then boom, you have this gigantic, cute hair bun. So for the next hairstyle, I'm just going to go ahead and take out these tendrils or antennas, whatever you call it, and just place it on the front. And boom, you have another hairstyle. Next up, we're going to do this really low ponytail hairstyle. You can just do a, a center part or a side part. You guys already know what my preference is. Just center part right there, pull the hair down, and there you go. All right, y'all, for this next hairstyle, do you think you know what I'll do next? Comment below if you think you know exactly what I'm going to do next. 
it's the tendrils yes so we have the little ponytail and now we took out the tendrils or the antenna and now we have another hairstyle so that's hairstyle number 14. The next hairstyle is similar to something you guys have already seen so I'm just going to take all my hair and put it to one side except for that one strand so it makes it seem like it's this kind of like distressed kind of look but I did it on purpose so everything to one side except for that one strand and yeah. And for our last and final style, you remember the scissors I had at the very beginning of the video? Yep, I'm going to go ahead and use that. I'm actually going to go ahead and cut my hair. I am going to be cutting a cute little bob, so make sure everything's all even and all around. Same length for the most part. I kind of put layers in it as well, like starting from the front and then working my way to the back. And yeah, this is the last and final hairstyle. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys on the next one. Be blessed, spread love, and stay beautiful inside and out. Bye guys!